down here at the Ganaraska River checking out of the salmon run. They're actually starting to run today. But everybody in Ontario who holds a fishing license got an email this morning saying between Jocelyn Street and the CN Bridge, the Ganaraska River has been closed. It's been marked as sanctuary to protect the migrating salmon spawn. I think anybody who's been following this knew that this was coming. I certainly expected this in 2025. I feel bad for young people who don't have boats and this is their big opportunity to catch salmon. But on October 15th, the river will reopen. You'll be able to fish for salmon and steelhead. The steelhead situation and that is another topic as we don't know what this extended season is going to do to them. The part that really scares me about this is that I have good information that in four days, the mayor of Port Hope, where I've lived for 41 years, managed to have the regulations changed for this season. Everybody got an email. The river is going to close September 1st. The part of this that really scares me is that what if somebody in a cod association decides they don't like tournaments and they have a little bit of pull with the Minister of Natural Resources and they have tournaments banned on their lakes maybe next weekend and we get an email about that or somebody decides that it's unethical to hunt white-tailed deer during their breeding season and we get an email in October about the 29th saying the gun season has been changed because they're unethical to hunt during the run. Scares me, it worries me that it was able to be done so fast, not actually what happened. So put your comments in the bottom. Maybe I'm an idiot. Maybe I don't know what I'm talking about, but I'm certainly interested in hearing from you, unlike the town of Port Hope.